Cristo. God is good at all the time. God is good. God is good at all the time. And all these say, God is good. And all the time. Thank you. My dear young people. We have the gospel about the call of the Apostle Matthew Levy seated at the tax collectors. Levy is you and me. Levy is you a young person working in this world, in this country, who is seeking connection with God. In the theme that today we want to celebrate in the World Youth Day theme, which is Mary went with haste to the mountain to her cousin Elizabeth, went with haste to accomplish a mission. Levi was told, follow me with haste. He got up from the table, he left the books, he left his past life, and went and threw a party for Jesus. Mary's encounter with God, if you could turn that speaker just a bit, so that it doesn't go this way, the feedback, if you could turn the speaker's ears. Mary met God. And in meeting with a calling that God gave her, immediately she took the hint that she was given. And that hint was that her cousin Elizabeth had also received a calling and needed help. So today, my dear young people, we are here to listen to an encounter, and that's why we were putting on our Wi-Fi. What does God say to me? What's his mission? What's the mission I'm getting? And that's what I want you first to ask yourself. Because God called you in your baptism. But it didn't end there. You are baptized and you are told you are mine. Say in the prophet Isaiah says, I have redeemed you. I have called you by your name. You are mine. What a beautiful name. What a beautiful address to you. Myself, Nini, Najita, Mungu Ameniabia, Anthony. I have redeemed you. I poured blood for you. I sent Jesus to pour blood for you. Anthony, I have called you by your name. Your nickname. You are mine. My young man, my young lady, God has called you in baptism. And we are here to renew. We are here to revive. We're here to, as it were, rekindle. Let us flame come back in fire, in fire, that your faith can be expressed. Because as time goes, in a in a in a fear, in and we blow that fire. Who broke it over? Who broke it over? Now, when that go up, when it comes to the motor, we are going to say, "Ma, Papa, I'm afraid I'm getting a lot of feedback, and yet I want to get those people." If someone could turn this mic, just this speaker's a bit. I know I was told I shouldn't come here because when I come here, we get feedback. And if we turn it looking like that, you turn it back this way later. Even that doesn't work. 
place in that way. I can come a bit closer to this. Blow, 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 blow. I just want to come up by the work. Eh, send the son of Adam. <laughs> I am uh, Hoto Hoto. We speak about faith on fire. I want to see whether that fire is going to catch. I do want a fire, 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 fire. Faith on fire. Go, 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 go. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a Fire, fire, fire. Faith on fire. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Gotcha. Fire, 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 kuwa cha uoga nyuma tumekuwa tumefifia katika imani hatujitokezi wakati tunaitwa kusimama imara na kristo levi akasimama to go with haste wale walikuwa kule wakiangalia kondo zao wachungaji when the shepherds were met when the, when the angels came and told the shepherds that the Savior had been born. Go! And what did they do? It was night with haste. They got up. Young men, young ladies, with haste. We must get up in order to live our faith and walk the path of faith to the mountains, to the encounter with Christ. We must walk up in our schools, in our working place, in our universities. We must walk with haste. Like people with decision, when they know they're going. Now with guys who are here, they are here. When I was a Jew, I was a Jew. When I was a Jew, I was a Jew. 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 That's why we are here. So today, we are called to move with haste. We are called to, after the encounter with Christ, we need repeated encounters so that this fire doesn't die. And that's the first thing I would like to ask the young people. That we must find encounters that speak of Christ. That strengthen one another and not destroy one another. It's a boogie. What is it not? What is it? Eh? Ambazo watu wanaingia tu Lile tunataka kuzindua jeshi Jeshi ya kristu Leo, leo, leo Ambayo naenda mahala kwa jua ni wapi Kyo, hivyo, hivyo Ambayo haisha toka kwa leli That's what we are saying We are here to stand firm with Christ We are here to renew You know, you wouldn't have come here if you were not ready isn't it wonderful to see how many young people are willing to make a sacrifice, travel the whole night, come suffer things, sometimes even without breakfast. That's what we are going to do. We are going to do it. Because we are going to pay the Christ. 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 We have a serious issue. And that's what the first thing we recognize. Young people, you come out because you love and you want to do what is right. But we need courage and the energy and the graces to accomplish this mission. Nandiyo mana tunasema, lazima wewe umuachilie kristu, ukimbie kwa mbio, kwa kasi, kutafuta urafiki. Kutafuta neema. Kutafuta mahala mbapa tunakutana kujenga mazoezi ya kiroho. We want to build muscles. We must have spiritual gyms. The problem with us is we spend so much in the physical gym. And so little in the spiritual gym. So 
So we end up with small muscles. Watu wako na mikono mikubwa, mikono mikubwa na tulivu tudodo. Watu wako na madhimbe, lakini tulikono hatumezi chochote. Watu wako na kichwa kubwa, lakini kumini likadogo. Watu wambao hawana proportion. So your spiritual life is muscleless. And that's the problem. Kwa hivyo unagongwa hivi kidogo, unanguka kwa sababu una maso. You can't resist. We must do spiritual exercises. I want to see whether we are ready. Sion? 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 Aha, aha, aha. Basi pam kidogo. Na weke soa kiasi. Aha, alafu. Tugo sao? Tugo sao? Ugo ni mwana? Aha. Iyo ni ya panda. Kuli ya panda ya mengia? Imengia? mazoezi ya kiroho unaitwa mnaitwa tukutane tuombe kuna spiritual sijui nini kuna kuna adoration unasema oi hiyo kitu ana ndio maana unagongo mara moja kwa sababu kuna roho ndogo kama ya kuku ndio <laughs> maana kushtuliwa hivi unapata hata <laughs> chao na vile kuku ukiweka kwa busu na kufa tu mara moja <laughs> ni kwa sababu ina roho ndogo sasa mnataka kiroho kama cha ndovu kina pump uputu na anapiga moja damu inatembea kote so this got to reach mass that's what we are speaking for one la pili tuko hapa kujua we are going with haste to do good and that actions of doing good are the ones which give us spiritual muscles Matendo ya huruma My young people our lady got quickly to go and help Elizabeth because she knew Elizabeth was elderly hapo na nguvu hapo na uwezo tayari alikuwa amezeeka alihitaji usaidizi but our lady didn't think about herself she thought about the neighbor she thought about Elizabeth she thought about the people around Hashtag your future my joy hashtag your success my joy hashtag your peace my joy celebrate when you help mercy that gives us the joy the joy of knowing nime kudumia fulani how many times young people we miss opportunities i've told this story so many times about my own failures ninakumbuka tukiwa na robi tulikuwa tunapanda kutoka nairobi hospital tunaendelea silver springs hotel wale wameenda nairobi wale wasioenda nairobi sijali utaenda siku moja hivi karibu tutajua nairobi We were climbing there and I was in my car working on my iPad. And as I was working, I saw on my left an elderly couple. And the elderly couple were holding a middle-aged man, he could have been 35, 40. He was hanging on the old man and hanging on an old lady. And he was trying to walk that hill. Surely he was sick. And there I was with my computer working trying to catch up with my work I looked up I saw I noticed but I looked down to my computer to work and the vehicle went up and then it hit me that person needed help that person you could have given her given her lift and so we were climbing up we already reached Silver Springs there was a jam so I told the driver at that moment it was We had gone already far, turn around, let's go and look for that. We turned around, we came down to Nairobi hospital again, we turned around. <coughs> By the time we started climbing, they were not there. They were not there. And I say to myself, 
you've lost that opportunity. You should have helped. You know you did, but you didn't. How many times we miss that opportunity? And you will always, up to now, I remember, it was already more than 10 years ago. But I still remember, the Lord asked me to do something. I was slow, and it didn't happen. Public confession. You too. How many times you've passed a needy brother, sister? You go and you see there's an old man struggling to cross the street. I say, oh, yes, yes, Baba. How's him doing? Achana nae. Awadu natuka, wanatoka gishagi, wanabuja kuku. Awadu kuku. Kuku kwa barabara. Achana nao. And you just pass. Today. Yesterday. The previous day. Maybe you pass through some guy who was very poor. Beggar. And you didn't even notice. How many beggars are around your street? Do you notice them? We are in Lent. What have you done already in the past week, Mesha? Mesaidia nani? Waja dufanya balls. Balls, balls. And the fathers in Goko. We are one week. How many of us have given arms, food, coins, Look to at least one needy person that first week of Lent. In one corner. One, two, three, four. My battery will go down. Thank you. Five, six, seven, eight. What are you doing? Guys. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. This is a video in the This is one I This is one of the This is one This is where we get our spiritual masters. Those are the only ones who turn to exercise. My dear young people, without giving, you never receive. When you give, your heart expands. When you care, your heart expands. Your muscles become able to receive Christ. When you receive, when you give, you become capable of giving your life. Like Matthew. Pasababu. Ujapatiana, your, your heart continues shrinking. Giving is expansion, is an exercise, mercy action to help the hungry, to feed the hungry, to feed and give drink to those who are not who are thirsty, to give clothing to those who are naked, to help those who are mourning, comfort them. This is our thing. This is our thing, young people. Liomana, situ ende tu kwa mazishi ya wanarika. Sio tu kwenda na huku wa saidia wakati walikuwa na shida na diki. La, sasa ndiyo wakati wakutenda machendo ya huku. Young guys, my young daughters and sons, unless you give you your life as a Christian, is still childlike, or better say childish. It's still immature. This is why giving is a must. Because as a sir, we must make a point. It doesn't matter what you give. I'm not asking how much you give. But young people, your motto to me say my faith and fire must be with actions. Coming from Nyeri, we must organize mercy actions. I must give me, 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 me. I must reach out to the people in my town. I must reach out to the people who I see on the road, to the people who I can help in the hospital, to the, my other younger people, the people who are in special needs. Our young people, there are people who, our young brothers and sisters, who need help. When I was in university, 
one of the persons who I thank God. He lost his sight. He's called now Justice and Buddha. He was in his second year. He got sick. He was injected with the wrong medicine. And within two hours, he became blind. We were taking turns to read for him so that he can take notes with his brain when he came back. This was the youth had organized an actual schedule of helping him. How much do we help our youth, our brothers and sisters? How much time do you have for those who are sick? How many do you know near you are in the hospital? Young people like you who need help. We must commit to action, mercy, actions. Uh -huh. Uh-huh. Actions of mercy. Hello. Hey, hello. Are you still there? Yeah. Don't hang up on me. <laughs> hello. Action mercy. Mercy. You go up. Amani. See Amani. Guruma. Guruma. Hello, go. Sikwadi. Mikanaju. Ay. You mean gia. You mean gia. Ya pili. Ya tatu. We are here knowing that as we journey together, kuna mitego tumewekewa. Wanarika, mungu anatupenda sana, lakini shetani hapendi hivyo. The devil knows you give power to these young people, they change the world for good. So, he comes into the mix to put traps for you. We are here to agree to fight together like we were doing in rugby, like we did at the beginning, to fight against the things that are attacking we, attacking us, the young people. The things, the traps that have been set against us. Shetani, anakujua, na kweli mwanarika, kwa sababu unangubu, and you have that decision and desire for goodness, you can change things. You can achieve great, but the devil doesn't want. So he gives you what is called paralysis, spiritual paralysis. My cousin got sick. Actually, it's my nephew, my cousin's son. He got sick with a very funny illness. The illness attacks the nerves. And as the nerves get attacked, the first thing is the nerves die and he's unable to breathe. And there I was trying to keep him company because even his eyes couldn't open. He could only communicate with a hand. And I remembered what I read about that worst poison that exists. The poison exists in Central American forests. It is a poison of a little frog that is called cocoa. Cocoa. A little frog this big, very small, but this frog has got the worst poison. And those guys in that forest, in the Amazon, the top of part of the Amazon or the forest down there, what they do is they catch a little frog and they put the little frog on fire so that it can secrete the poison from its back. And they take small darts, like small, small darts, this big, and they roll it on top of this frog so that the poison can get onto the dirt. And then this dirt is put into a blow pipe. A blow. They, they, they blow the, the dirt in a long bamboo. Bamboo blower pipe as it were. And so if you are far, they get you. Poof, and so the dirt goes. Sit. Now, <clears throat> that poison is so bad that it does not have, it just needs to graze you, Kidogo, and the poison goes into the body. And what does that poison do? The poison slowly makes the muscles relax. The muscle of the hand relaxes. The poison goes into the body, is taken by the blood. The muscles of the limbs relax. After that, the muscles of the lungs relax. And you are unable to breathe. And then finally, the muscles of your heart relax. And it stops beating so you die. 
of relaxation. <laughs> That's the poison the devil is using more often with the young people. Ah, bana, don't exaggerate. Zitu wacha. Izo amri ni kweli, ni kumi lakini wacha. Just relax, bana. Relax. It's not so bad. Relax. We are going to do nothing. Relax. Ah, hii kitu sio mbaya sana. That movie is okay. Relax, bana. Wacha ma stress. That is where we are betraying our faith. That we are relaxing in our demands of morals. That we are relaxing in the things we are watching. That we don't have the courage to tell a guy, hey, a movie, this movie, I, the movie see, this is not my type. I'm sorry, I'm not watching it. This party is not my kind of party. I ain't going there. <laughs> Hapo sitafika hata ukiniambia nini sitaingia kwa hiyo bogi Sita sita come up Where is your courage? Where is your courage? Where is your courage? This is when we decide we Catholics use we are setting our agenda it will not be set for us because that relaxation makes people capture hijack you into things you don't want to do that's why today we are asking for the courage to say yes like matthew for the courage to say yes like mary for the courage to go out in search of others like us ready to fight in this battle of christ Ukiitwa na Yesu Tikaitika Tikaitika Ndiyo Tikaitika Tikaitika Ukiitwa na Yesu Tikaitika 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 Kama sio mimi mwenyewe Kama sio Kamasio 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 mimi dada wewe dada wewe wewe ndugu kama sio wewe na mimi basi ujasiri utatoka wapi basi tutatetea kristu lini basi tutapindua hizi bogi za jipano hiyo hiyo tutapindua hizo kesi ya kristu lini if it is not you who can stand up who is going to stand up mimi nataka kuona ni nani atasimama na Kristo? Tena hiyo na nataka sasa kusikia. Na nataka kusikia mambo yote. Nani nani nani? Haya. Haya. Hiyo ni nini? Ya tatu. My dear ones, we need courage against the laziness that the poison of the devil is giving us. But that's not enough. He gives the peddlers of lies and evil jamene wanangu wapendwa allow me just to say this please i know there are so many attractive things you want to try but please 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 and i want you to tell your neighbor please please look at the grass
hiyo waje na mfuka na vitu vingine mada mwambie wewe mwenzako hiyo wacha Ndiyo Mambo Everything is not all negative. We want to pray for your future. Don't lose hope. Don't lose hope. You may have a degree. You may have looking for a job for two years, three years, four years, five years. Six. You may be that you have great dreams. Lakini bado uko pale kwa step A, step one. Labda uko kwa boda. Labda uko kwa hii hasla ni nini ya mabizna. Labda uko katika chapashi. Labda uko katika dhambuta. Unajua vitu vyote. Labda hata labda hujafika kwa sambusa uko bado kwa mara yani ile basic boiro mara boiro hiyo ndio unaunga hiki utapanda utapanda utafika but don't 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 let yourself go into trust my dear young people if the young people who are catholic young people decide we are not let's say it in a bit we ain't getting involved in that stuff hey, amen God will bless you. The first reading from the prophet Isaiah says, if you get away from your wickedness, if you care for that person who is a widow, the one who is sick, if you stop harassing the people, if you decide that the day of the Lord will be honored, if you decide to be going to church and to honor the prayer regime, if this time of Lent you decide to pray and to do good, be sure I will remember you. I will bless you. I will lift you. Who is that who is going to be blessed? It's you. It's you. But he's got his time. God has got his own time. He's got own time. Not yours. Not yours. Wait for God. My time. That's what you got to do. Don't hurry, God. Mungu, inastaji sasa niwe katika sijui wapi. Tuliza boli. Take it easy. The time is coming. You will have your time. God will bless you. Please don't hurry, God. And that's what is making us become thieves. Thieves. Because we want the money hurriedly. And eventually, it eats us up and destroys us. That's what God has promised you. That he wants to bless you. If this time of Lent, this time we've come to the world youth day, experience in year. This time we've met with Mary walking with haste to the mountain. We also decide to walk in haste to do good. To walk in haste to 
uproot the evil that is in our heart. I have wrong things that I do. I get angry. I get impatient. I think ill of people. I have to get rid of that. You have your own fights. Unabujiwa na kapome. Unabujiwa na sejui kasigara ndef. Unabujiwa, unasikia muziki. Ati unamiambia, ayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayayay
hii ni basi hii ni basi ya kungoma hii ni basi ya kungoma kama si tunakosea hapo naona na wajua tunaona hii watu ya mbembe Aha. Wapi ingine? Aliomba jana Rosari. Aha, hawa si basi, hawa ni loko. Na kule jameni, my dear young people, jishike hapa. How can we say we love Mary? If it is the last thing we are doing. Jameni, hii Rosari iwe my lifeline. My Rosari hashtag my Rosari my lifeline. Hello? Hashtag my courageous life where you are not going to be shaken where you are going to have that big heart to do acts of mercy where you are going to blow that fire of faith so that you are not scared of those around you where you are going to make acts of mercy to those around you then our youth to sustain with haste going to the encounter of Christ then the encounter today with our lord who have had name may god bless you all may god bless your life give you great success in whatever you are doing above all make you very holy lovely daughters and worthy sons of god our father to see you so christ Yeah, yeah, yeah.